So what is up guys, you got your boy, Jet Sting here today, and today we're going to be reacting to the Street Fighter 6 teaser trailer. Now, it's of course, it's only the teaser trailer, it's only just a little bit of, you know, it's probably just going to show like a little bit, maybe some game, but I have not seen it yet. Of course, I've been waiting to see it, I'm, uh, I just got home from work, so I was able to finally come home, catch it, we're going to talk about it, talk about a few things that I want to see within Street Fighter 6 and talk about some of the things that I've heard. I've heard a few things already. I've been kind of staying away from the video itself because that's the big thing. But anyway, let's get right into this reaction. I'm a real looking kind of jack, bro. Not gonna try to just rewrite it right off the bat because of the head, man. Oh boy, real really looking like a my boy, real really looking like a father. Hold on, that boy got a beard and everything. <laughs> my boy, father. <laughs> okay, the logo is a little bit interesting. All right, so that was the teaser trailer. That was actually pretty nice. Um, it's it's simple, you know, just showing Ryu and, and uh, the, the new fighter, and that's just you know you you can't really really react too much off of that because there's not really nothing hype happening in this. This is really just you know the, the reveal. You know, it's it's here, it's coming. Um, from what I've been told, uh, I believe we will not get any sort of news information about Street Fighter 6 until the summer of 2022. For what I was told from, I believe, the Capcom Twitter uh, page, it said, there won't be anything coming about this game until summer 2026, so we can only hope to speculate for the next few months to see what could happen within Street Fighter 6. Now, I will want to talk about a few things that I want to see within Street Fighter 6, uh, just kind of from the you know the little bit that I played of Street Fighter 5 and you know maybe some characters I would want to see in 6 so I'm gonna break this video up into three whole cuts so I'm obviously this part was just the reveal the reaction nothing really too hype about that but seeing Ryu look the way he looks with the beard now definitely took me by surprise I'm not gonna hold you the Street Fighter 6 logo in itself it's a little bit different than what you see in standard Street Fighter games but I don't think that's gonna like uh, I don't think it really matters that much to me. Like I, I, I'm not really too deep on the whole. Well, it doesn't look like standard game, so I might be doing something a little bit different. Of course, change is always good if it's in the right hands. I do trust Capcom a little bit with the idea of changing the logo, but of course, it's gonna be mainly just the gameplay and the actual game for me. So there's that. But I'm going to break this up into three parts. I'm going to be talking about characters I would like to see and things I would like to see. So characters I would like to see is just, of course, some of the returning characters that probably didn't make it into 5. Now, remember, I wasn't a super active 5 player, and I did not partake in most of the DLC. I was like, I was kind of like early 5 player, but then kind of drifted out once, you know, once other games that came out. So, uh, characters I would love to see in Street Fighter 6 is Elena. Uh, Sakura, um, Yang and Yun, um, Jury. I want, I want, I want them to keep Jury. I want to see Cami come back. There's a lot of characters that I would love to see to come back into this game series, and you know, just really do it for me. This is gonna tie into one of the things I want to see out of Street Fighter Six as a whole, but. I really just want to see some of those characters come back. Like, Sakura would be a big one for me because Sakura is really one of my favorite characters in the Street Fighter series. Uh, she was actually my main. When I used to play a little bit of competitive Street Fighter, when I played 4, the arcade edition, she was kind of like my go-to. Either her or um, her or Yang was kind of like my primary picks in terms of uh, picking characters. Uh, another character I would love to see is uh, E. Honda. Just because, just man. You know, we gotta have classics like Balrog. If we, if I don't see Balrog in six, I'll be moderately confused because why? Why would it not? Like he's such a staple in the Street Fighter series. Just put that boy in. Also, Sean from Street Fighter like third, uh, third, uh, third Impact, I believe. Put him in. <laughs> like where has he been? Five Boy has been on permanent vacation since forever. <laughs> he was super good. I think I think he was super good in the third one, and then. 
like just gone from the other games. It's just like, bro, come on, man, give give us Sean or something. You know, there's a lot of characters that I would want to see within the Street Fighter, uh, the Street Fighter Six world, and I want them to see, you know, a little bit of a fresher take on these type of things. So, there's that. Street Fighter Six. All right, so those are the characters I would like to see. Uh, a few things that I would really, really like to see amongst um, the Street Fighter Six games itself. One, I want to see a healthy cast on launch. Uh, I know, I remember hearing that Street Fighter V when I early played the game. Uh, I remember a lot of people were not happy with the initial cast of Street Fighter V. And it was because the cast was so little. You know what I mean? So, I would love to see a healthy cast. Give us maybe like 20 characters maybe to start off with. I'd even say maybe an 18. I'd be, I'd be okay with 18 even. If you got 18 characters to play with just out of the gate, I'd be okay with that. It's quite obvious I feel like they would be adding more characters with DLC packs in the future. So, of course, they're probably going to round up the roster even more. So, it'll probably go 18 into maybe like 30 depending on what type of characters they would like to add into the series itself. So, I would say at least start with a healthy cast. Don't give us like five characters to choose from and then you know expect players to play for months and months and months until the new DLC comes out and then new characters are then acquirable so if we start at least at healthy base then you know people will be able to at least find a little bit more of a comfortable main that plays to their style and that gives them a better chance to enjoy Street Fighter 6 in my honest opinion um I really just hope that there's a lot of competitive support. I mean, it is Street Fighter, so it's going to get a lot of competitive support. It's going to get a lot of tournament play. It's going to get a lot of, uh, you know, big deal uh, players coming out of the new woodwork. They're probably going to get some new names that are going to be coming into the scene. I myself probably will not be one of those names. I don't actively plan to get competitive in Street Fighter. I'll probably just pick it up for, you know, casual fun matches with friends. Maybe I might do some streams here and there just to play, but I'm not really looking into getting super super competitive with Street Fighter games uh, I'm more of a casual player more these days so there's that but I would love to see a lot of competitive support for the game I have even seen some games before where you know you expect them to have it because they're just a stack this type of game there this is an arena fighter game it has to have competitive support but some games don't have it for some reason and that's a little bit alarming because considering that's the structure of the game itself you know you gotta give you know some promotion it's a promotion. I know Capcom definitely has the ability to promote. I know we are in a, you know, pandemic world right now where it's a little bit harder. It's, you know, going up and then going down and then going back up. So it may not be the easiest to perform at tournaments. But, of course, they can always do online. So I'm winning, hoping to see a lot of that. I will be looking forward to seeing some of these services because tournament matches are just some of the most fun things to watch when you're on your downtime for me. Personally for me, like it's some of the most fun because you really get to see the thought process, the, the aggression, the drive, the, 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 the ability to win with these people. So that's just one of the things I love to watch in tournament matches. I do think winning tournament matches is super big for a lot of people. So, you know, whoever decides to play Street Fighter uh, 6 competitively, good luck to you guys because I want to see, I want to see, I want to see people win. I want to see the attitudes, I want to see the vibe, I want to see the energy. All that stuff, I want to see that because that is going to be personally exciting. But that's really just it. It's only just really one thing. I just, well, it's just a couple things. I just want to see a healthy cast and competitive support. That's really just it. I just that's all I really want from Street Fighter uh, Six. I don't want really nothing in particular yet because we don't know what's in already. So that's why I was like, ah, I kind of just had a little bit of a uh, just kind of just like kind of broad ideas. That will be safe to pick from until we see a little bit more news. Now, of course, we won't see anything until summer of 2022, as I mentioned earlier. So we won't know anything just yet. But that's going to be it for this video. What do you guys think about Street Fighter Six? Do you guys think that this was a uh, this is a great announcement to make, considering it was the whole countdown thing? Or are people a little bit disappointed about Street Fighter Six, which is a reveal for not a more uh welcome the game or some other different game on new ip or anything like that so let me know in the comments section below let me know what characters you would like to see in street fighter 6 as well and what are some of the things you would like to see in street fighter 6 this has been your boy jc and i'll see you guys next time peace